Harrisburg baseball has their sights set on the program's third state championship. First since 2003-04. We go beyond the highlights with the Bulldogs as they look to make a championship run. Good teams find ways to win. Through their first three playoff games, Harrisburg outscored opponents 40-5. to In the sectional championship, they trailed Carterville 2 to nothing, but never panicked and relied on their defense. We make plays, uh, we, and we make hard plays look easy. And so, you know, all the homers and stealing home and all that, that gets, you know, that's cool and all, but uh, what wins games is coming out and making plays every day. It's such a big part of the game. Just little mistakes can kill you. I mean, as you saw with us, we're a pretty good team. We've played baseball since we were eight years old. We know we can do what we do. We can hit the ball, we can run, we can field, and if we just stick to the basics, we can scratch and claw and fight our way back to get the lead. While the defense kept the Bulldogs in the game, understanding situational hitting gave Harrisburg the lead for good. They got on base, and two sack flies put them out in front in the sectional championship. We really understand the situations pretty well. Coach Thompson preaches it every day, and at the beginning of the year, we weren't really good at situational hitting and bunting and stuff like that, but we've gotten a lot better, and I think that's going to pay off in the next couple games. At the end of April, former big leaguer Blake DeWitt talked to the team about situational hitting. That pep talk got through to the Bulldogs. I think after that, you know, we kind of started to turn around our situational hitting and we just started uh, scoring more runs. In the playoffs, you need guys to step up in order to advance. Javi Beal only pitched three times all year, but he came through when his team needed him. Uh, it felt good to be up there and coach was looking for somebody to compete and Rue does that. He gave us a good start and I knew I was going to come behind him and compete as well, so I loved it. The Bulldogs are locked in but also are staying loose, having fun, and enjoying the moment. And we've been here before with the team two years ago. We missed out on it last year, and this year, I mean, it's just incredible being here again. We hear before every game, coach tells us, hey, win today, win today. And I think that's what we focus on the most. Obviously, you know, we want to get up there to Illinois State and play, but right now we're just worried about the first game that we have to win.